next program write an alp2 uh, divide 8 bit number okay stored at 1331h and store the result in that quotient and remainder in uh, next two location 32 and 33h actually the syllabus is uh, is an alp to perform division operation of 8 bit number by 8 bit number so i am writing the same addition program so two locations content you are taking and uh, you are storing the quotient and remainder in the next two locations okay open the kill tool so i am taking the data present in 30 and 31 h okay 30 and 31 h content i am taking i am dividing the content present in 30 h by 31 h so in both the location 8 bit data are there so it is a division of 8 bit by 8 bit so move r not with 30 h because i want to get the data of 30 h location so move r not immediate value of 30 dash means immediate data of 30 h now take the value move a comma at r not move a comma at r not so the address 30 h content will be moved to a accumulator next 31 content also i want so increment r not so r not will be incremented to 31 now it is now 31 h after increment now let me take this uh, 31 h content in the register b so move b comma at r not first we have taken move a comma at r not now i am taking the second data in move b comma at r not after that we have instruction div a b div a b no comma div a b continuous so d i v so it is going to perform a by b so register a content is 8 bit data is divided by register b 8 bit content and after that your uh, quotient will be present in uh, a okay after division resist accumulator a this a is accumulator a contains okay accumulator a register okay a register means accumulator register contains quotient and b register contains b register contains remainder you can uh, show uh, you can see after this after you can verify the answer in a and b register only if you want to move the answer in next two location 32 and 33 h so you have to do the increment first so that uh, it will increment by one more time so now 30 becomes 31 h after that 32 h now pass that uh, quotient from accumulator to at or not move at or not this is destination at or not is the destination source is a from accumulator move to the address specified by or not after that to store the quotient also one more time increment or not again from b also you can move it to at or not symbol okay so you can verify the answer here so i'm going to start now uh, you have to remove the open uh, previous you have to stop debug previous program if any running you have to stop debug so that once you right click you can just directly remove the file so now I'm going to add new item and uh, you can type uh, ASM file and type sub 8 and add and type this program and save it as dot as dot uh, a51 or ASM file. So I already typed the program and saved. So I'm going to select the option add existing file. Already the file is there, so I'm going to just add it. Uh, you people have to type new file and type this program i already have so i'm going to select that file okay so if you double click this program is coming so now build target okay line number six error is there so i think uh, okay extra save it so zero errors zero warnings after that start debug so i have to give the data in uh, 30 and 31 h so open memory window one you click on this open memory window one you will get here here you have to type 0x30 
so i am taking the data from 30h so in 30h i am actually giving 0 9 double click i am giving 0 2 so 9 divided by 2 4 is the quotient remainder is 1 so 4 should come here 1 should come here so give only data to 30h and and 31h this is 30 this is 31 this is 32 this is 33 locations so here i am giving 9 as the data 8 bit data and 2 as the 8 bit data 4 is the quotient 1 is the remainder so that is the output you have to you can expect here so let me do step by step step over move you have to open you have to click the register tab this is a project window so rnet is loaded with address of the memory first data is taken to accumulator increment or not take the second data to b seen is here 9 and 2 we have taken using indirect addressing mode after that div a b d i v div a b without space so you can see here after vision okay these are the highlighted values so a is containing quotient b is containing one so from accumulator you have to move it to the next location so increment or not and store the accumulator content to this 32 location so 4 will come here okay next again increment or not and store the b content to next location so you can observe 4 is coming here quotient 1 is remainder similarly you can give any value any 8 bit value you can give 55 divided by 3 that is hexadecimal values okay you can verify the answer data so you can give restart give i'll give some 75 divided by 23 okay 75 divided by 23 so let me check what is the answer C3 is coming and C is coming. 3 and C is coming. So if you want, you can verify the calculator. So I had given. Hexadecimal 75. Divided by 23. 3 is the. Quotient. Okay and c 12 is the remainder if you divide 75 decimal hexadecimal divided by 23 hexadecimal so answer is this so you can give smaller number and you can uh, uh, verify okay thank you